The F-35 is not the only advanced fighter. So what makes the F-35 the fighter of the future? Why can't other countries keep up with the F-35? Growing up, I used to relate stealth to lightning fast and silent bombers like the Blackbird. Dogfighting was left to the thundering fighter jets. Never had I thought that I would witness the fundamental shift where fighter jets would evolve into a whispering angel of death. The US military is hot on wheels to realize a sixth generation stealth fighter that would totally reduce all enemy air defenses into nothing but an inconvenience. This development is proving to be having more impact on the F-35 as it keeps getting upgrades. Seems like the future sixth gen fighter is nothing more than an upgraded F-35. When the F-35 was unleashed to the world, it was riddled with technical mishaps that drew criticism from all corners, including American allies. We will not buy the F-35 fighter jet. Like Canada, but not too fast. The F-35 is a modern, reliable and agile fighter aircraft, and it is the right aircraft for our country. The world is waking up to the reality that the F-35 might dominate the future as the most lethal fighter ever seen. The US and its allies' next-generation response to its next-generation problems is the F-35. Designed to turn potential threats from hostile airspace into enemy air targets and guarantee US aviation supremacy for many years to come. Some countries are competing to buy F-35s even though they have previously given the aircraft a poor assessment. The F-35 is not the only advanced fighter. So what makes the F-35 the fighter of the future? Why can't other countries keep up with the F-35? The F-35A, which was the most affordable and basic variation of the F-35 and lacked the VTOL and larger wingspan of the other variants, which would have made it the most popular for export, replaced the F-16 and its peers. Subsequently, the F-35B, which replaced the Harrier, gained popularity among customers like the Japanese Navy and the Royal Navy. Its VTOL capabilities enabled even smaller, less expensive helicopter carriers to project more power than they had previously. The wide-winged F-35C, which replaced the F-A-18, which are widely used in the US Navy, was the last model. Because of its wider wingspan, it may have been the most visually striking of the two. There you have it. With the VTOL capabilities of its B variant, the F-35 is sufficiently varied to be a game changer right away and a force multiplier even to smaller, less expensive helicopter carriers, enabling them to project power more than previously. Thanks to the F-35's unique capability, smaller armies may now match greater naval powers for lethality. In the same light, the VTOL feature of the F-35 variant provides the potential of hibernating tactics deployed by the Army where an aircraft lays silent in the battlefield and waits for orders for fast surprise attacks. Hey. These tactic is already in use, especially with the Apache divisions within some Western armies. This baby has a lot more hiding under her skirt. Yes, the Chinese J-20 can carry a bit more missiles and fly a little bit faster. However, it's the sensors on the F-35 that really do the killing. Because of the F-35's remarkable yet intricate strengths, it can be challenging to comprehend why this aircraft is so revolutionary. This does, however, partially explain why the F-35 is a bit of an underdog, since most people are more concerned with the easily understood fundamentals, like speed, appearance, turn radius, and so forth. This makes sense, Yet none of these issues are quite as significant as people might believe. The fact that 70-80% of pilots who had survived being shot down during World War II in Vietnam said they had no idea they were being targeted in the first place indicates how important situational awareness was to being the hunter rather than the prey in aerial combat. The F-35 uses a variety of systems, including its distributed aperture system, DARS, more precisely, the ANAC-37 electro-optical DARS, to guarantee this. If I can put it plainly, the situation awareness of the F-35 is already remarkable and it keeps getting better, surging light speed ahead of pairs. The DARS system consists of six infrared sensors with wide-angle lenses that provide 360 degrees of spherical coverage, looking in all directions to ensure that nothing is missed. This setup allows both short to medium range enemy vehicle tracking and the identification and tracking of incoming missiles. 
did because all of this information is sent straight to the pilot's visor, the F-35 is able to launch missiles at targets that are behind it. It's amazing that the F-35 can track and identify targets up to a distance of 1,000 miles. The F-35 holds the best situational awareness of any fighter in the skies to this day and for many years to come. But that's only the unclassified stuff. UF's most recent stealth coding innovation, the F-35, uses its brand new fiber mat radar absorbent substance. Furthermore, the most recent design method and simulation are used to determine the ideal shape for accomplishing such covert qualities. Although an official declassified value does not exist, the F-22 is thought to have a frontal radar cross-section of approximately 1.5 meters. Four-star General Mike Hostage of the United States Air Force claims that the F-35 appears to exceed this. It goes without saying that the aircraft's electronic warfare capabilities will also be used to neutralize adversarial systems. Armed to the teeth and equipped with the ability to locate and engage anything in the skies today, the F-35 is extremely difficult to identify, track and engage. Hold on a second. Even though the F-35 is sweeping the globe, it isn't the fastest fighter. The F-35 is by no means a slacker and is perfectly capable of traveling above supersonic speed. But many people saw this maximum speed as a drawback as other planes could travel faster than the Joint Strike Fighter. To be clear, this is not a problem at all. Rather, it is the outcome of extensive research on previous conflicts to determine the precise speed requirements. As you want to build an aircraft that is as fast as possible, you have to give up other advantages like payload, range, and, in the modern world, stealth. Over the years, America has honed in on the manufacturing and maintenance of the F-35, driving production costs lower whilst improving the technology. All these means is that there will be more F-35 in the international market, completely surpassing any other fighter.